Hey, this is Ghost Adam here at the Pro Audio Star Warehouse, and today we're going to check out the Allen & Heath Zone DX. It's a four-channel controller from Allen & Heath. It's pretty new, pretty cool. Let's go get it out of the warehouse right now. Alright, here it is. Let's take it over to the Wing Sound Studio to try it out. The Zone DX, it's a four channel controller from Allen & Heath. It's the only controller currently that works with Serato Itch, which comes bundled with. The Zone DX lets you control four channels of audio. Here are your volume faders here with a crossfader in the middle. You can assign each channel to either side of the crossfader with these switches here. Cue them up in headphones and preview tracks on the fly. Above that is your EQ section that lets you EQ each channel. The trim for each channel is above that. And then I have sends for my effects decks above that. I can send each channel to either one of the effects decks or both at the same time. Controlling the effects happens right here at the top of the mixer. You can scrub through effects as well as turn them on and off and set them to the tempo or tap in your own tempo here. Below that is the loop section. This is where you can turn on or off loops at different loop points in the songs. You can set them ahead of time or on the fly. Pushing in this knob here actually enables a loop roll also, which is a cool function and it's a popular feature of both Serato Scratch and Itch. Below that is my transport section. This is where I can load up tracks, set my different cue points, set my BPMs, cue and playback from different parts, assign up to four assignable cue points down here at the bottom that I can either set in real time or do ahead of time so I can play them live. This jog wheel will let me scrub through a track when it's paused so I can get to the individual point that I wanna be at. And while the song is actually playing, I can nudge the song forward or backwards to make sure it's in sync with the other tracks playing. She doesn't treat you, treat you. I'm gonna break down doing some mixes on the Zone DX. The first thing I did was load up a track here in my left deck. Instead of a pitch slider, I actually have a pitch wheel that I can use to get this up to the speed I want. Then I can go ahead and hit the play button and use the cue to get back to my play point. Or I can use these four assignable cue points to play my song in. Cool, so once that track is going, I'm gonna go over to my first deck on the right Scroll down to the next song in my library, load it up. I can use the sync button to sync it up. Make sure it's in time. Then drop that in the right time. I'll set a loop here on the left side. Then I'll go to my second deck on the left side. Scroll down, load up my next track. Make sure that's synced. I'll go to my second deck on the right, scroll down, load up another song. I'm gonna use the effect to get out of this a little bit. So we mixed all four tracks, transitioned into a new track and then I can go ahead and load up my next set of tracks using the first deck on the left. I can have some fun with the effects while that's coming in. I've got Echo on the right and a Bit Crusher on the left. For more on the Zone DX and other Allen & Heath products, check out ProAudioStar.com. You can be our friend on Facebook and follow our blog to see up to the minute info on DJ and audio gear. And for the best smoking deals, give us a call at ProAudioStar.com.